West Coast Expeditions, we're all about connecting people with the, the local place, uh, with diverse West Coast experiences. So we do that out of our wilderness retreat base here on Spring Island, largely through sea kayak outings. Sea kayak tours from the base camp and multi-day expeditions that are anywhere from four to eight days in length. And a lot of on-land exploring, shoreline exploring, old growth forests, and lots of time connecting with local Aboriginal culture and uh, some of the people that make this a beautiful part of the world. We're on the westernmost island in Canada where we could be doing what we're doing. And the infrastructure allows us to be comfortable regardless of, of the weather. There's always an adventure to be had, uh, stuff to explore, things to learn about. Literally three minutes away from where the tents are, you're in old growth Sitka spruce and western red cedar, 800 to 1,000 years old. So we've got a trail that's about a kilometer across the island, single track up and around and over and under, that links to some expansive beaches on the outside of Spring Island, the exposed coast, where there's storm watching or serene sunsets. So lots to uh, access on foot here too. The dining shelter is set up as a guest living space and, and our uh, meal prep area with our chef. And it's been standing in a very similar footprint since 1988 when it first went up. We've been operating around marine ecology, uh, education, community interactions for over 40 years and we've been doing that in one location. That's pretty unique. I think people, uh, they get to experience a remote, wilderness, diverse West Coast experience with a lot of things that keep it comfortable, accessible, and well outside of the box of, of what they do on their own. For many of our guests, uh, they consider this a second home, and they feel at home when they arrive back, and that just feels right.